Hey guys, welcome back to the second part of this booster box opening and part three of the entire Easter special. This will be the last part of the booster box itself. Um, as well uh, as we already opened 14 packs, not 15. I kind of counted after I finished the last video and realised I didn't do 15. So I'll do 16 to make it 30. Uh, nice round number. So we'll get straight into it. So I haven't received the shinies just yet, but I have got quite a few hollows, a few doubles actually as well, which is going to happen with these old sets. But they're really nice hollows too. I have to say that Hound Doom is definitely my favourite, but I do like the Aerodactyl as well. Okay, so we have a Sea King, a Graveler, an Unknown Bee, a Slugma, Golding, Smoochum, Swinub, Apom, a Quagsire, and a Suicune. So I've already got this one. But it's a really good card too. I've got all three legendary dogs actually. The last one ended with the last legendary dog I needed. I'm not too sure if there's any other versions of it, but I think that's it really for the Japanese set. Because we don't really have too many different versions. But I don't think this one they do. I just really want to get that Shining Gyarados at the very least. Which will be awesome. Okay. Alright, so Parasect. Graveler. Stantler. Zubat, Paris, Slugma, Remoraid, Chinchow, Apom, and. Oh, sweet! Look at that! That's a really awesome Seedra. I remember this card as well. It's been a long time since I've opened Neo Revelation. I think it was January last year when I started opening the English Neo set. So I haven't seen this for a while, but that's really awesome. Definitely don't have that card already, so that's awesome. Nice one. I really do. I'm beginning to appreciate I mean, I already have, but. Keep on re-appreciating if that makes sense. Um, the awesome Japanese cards, because you know it was more about you know getting the English ones, but now I'm kind of I'm quite into the Japanese ones too. Okay. Ooh. Okay, so we've got Seeking, a Lantern, Stantler, um, Paris, Goldine, Stay, Remoraid. Chinchow, Apom, and another oh, Sweet Coon. <laughs> oh, all water there. Yeah. Okay, I think the spinder for this box is um, so far Ampharos, though. It was for Neo Genesis as well. I got loads of Ampharoses for that. Okay, my cargo, artillery, graveler. Paris, Slugma, Chinchow, a Farfetch'd, a Pump, Quagsire, and a Porygon. Two. I don't think Porygon is in this one though. Not too sure. Need to check it out. It's not a huge set, so I'm pretty sure I'll complete the commons and uncommons by now. Okay. Alright, Octillery, Raichu, the Berry, uh, Paris, Goldine, Staryu, Chinchow, Swinub, Murkrow, and another Cedra. <laughs> That's funny. It's like Suicune, Cedra, Suicune, Cedra. Except Porygon sport that pattern. Now, I'd actually like for another reprint set to be made, I think. As in. A reprint set of the old set, so like to pay homage to the original ever cards. I kind of want another base, a base reprint to be honest. Um, but I doubt they'd do that because they've made so many reprints and they probably will have trouble as well since Wizards of the Coast um, had the original license. I don't know if they they probably still have rights to the images and stuff there. I don't know. Would be cool though, I think. All right, so Jinx, uh, Raichu, Unknown B, Paris. Slugma, Coolfish, Apom, Murkrow, uh, some sort of rod, and another Houndoom. Definitely my favourite card of this whole set. It's bloody, bloody cool. Okay, so that is six packs down. And there are ten to go. One shiny. Better be one. Okay, 
Go back. Jinx. Stantler. Paris. Coalfish. Chinchow. Smoochum. Swinub. Apom. And an NT. Gotta love that NT. Actually, I think I prefer the Raikou of the three legendaries. I think the Raikou is pretty awesome. Um, but yeah, I think Cedar is probably my third favorite card after Houndoom and Aerodactyl. Really want to see another fossil one. I think I've said that already, but I really want to see one of the fossil set. Okay, Flaffy, Graveler, Ooh. Um, some sort of field. Um, Zubat, Paris, Goldie, Staryu, Murkrow, Skip Bloom, and another Deli Bird. Now, this was one card I seriously needed for Revelation, and I think I got it in my last pack. I can't remember what it was. It was one card I needed, and I, and I got it in my last pack, and it was just such so lucky because it was the last one I needed to complete the whole set just from one box. So, Octillery, Flaffy, Graveler, Zubat, Goldeen, Smoochum, Geodude, Snubble, Murkrow, and another Amphrost. It's not a bad Amphrost though. It's kind of boring at the same time. There's no scenery in it. Alright, I think because the first part and the YouTube's videos would have had the similar cards in it, it's because, you know, because it is very, very small set. I'm just going to go and give you guys a hollow now just to speed things up a little. Okay, so let's check out what this one is. Probably a Porygon Deli Bird. Yep, Porygon 2. There you are. And there's nothing in here that will probably be a repeat. Okay. Now that's... This is our tenth pack. Grass Pokemon, probably skip Jumpluff. Yep, Jumpluff. Yeah, I was going to say skip Loom, but I realised it wasn't a rare. I like that Rocket Rare. Put Gengar on it. Pretty random. Okay, our 11th pack. I bet you the Shining card is probably not in these packs, one of these packs anyway. Okay, so look. Sweet Coon. Nice. I mean, it's probably in one of these packs, but it's not the packs that I'll open today, oddly enough. Alright, i um, going to get down to the last three packs. Um, I'll open 17 because, um, rather than 16, because that will leave 18 packs as opposed to 19. And I like an even number. <laughs> it's the way I roll. If you were wondering why there was a random cut just there in the video, it's because I dropped my camera again. Hooray. I always manage to drop the camera. It's a weird angle, anyway. It's an Aerodactyl, that's nice. I'm glad I got another one of this. There's one double I really want, it's this. I've got a few now, I think. I think that's my th fourth one. But it's expected. Right. There we go again. The camera was about to fall. Actually, you're dead. At least it didn't crash this time. Okay. <laughs> two more packs. Okay. Well, this pack isn't opening very easily. Okay, there we are. Progress. Alright, here we go. It's another Entei. And yeah, there's a regular card there. Alright, last pack of the video. Right. Hope it's a good one. I would just want to see the water. If it's a water, then it could be shining, but if not, it's not. It's a fire. It's another ho oh though. That's actually really good. I'm really glad to see that. It's my second one. I haven't actually got a double of this, so I didn't want at least another extra if I was meant to be getting doubles. 
So nice. Okay, so that concludes that part of the Easter special. So um, I hope you guys uh, enjoyed that. Uh, um, the Neo navigation system and this one. Um, fortunately, there's no shining, but hopefully we'll get some more videos up. Um, I probably will try and get some more videos up, um, which don't involve Easter, or um, we'll get a live show done with a few packs. We'll see what we'll see how it goes. Um, for now, thank you guys for tuning in, um, and we'll see you when um, Anya's on her little hunt for eggs, chocolate eggs, as you can see in the background. And that'll be the next part and the last part of this whole series. So tune in then, we'll see you then. Um, and I think the day of posting this as well, um, we'll be at the black and white pre-release, so we'll be recording that, and we'll get that up after the whole Easter thing as well. So see you then, bye.